173000 bucks. Same house folks bought for the same price. Uh, how would you feel if your monthly taxes were $434 higher than your neighbor with the exact same house? If taxpayers only knew what realtors know, the entire county should be a crime scene. Mike Suley is a realtor, an appraiser, and a paid assessment consultant for Allegheny County. He showed us home after home with the assessed value so wrong, some residents are being gouged while their neighbors save thousands. Take a look at this one. The couple who bought this weed-covered home with holes in the roof, a dilapidated back deck, boarded up windows, problem after problem. All these people are paying right now more than double the taxes they should because the county assessed their fixer-upper at twice what they paid for it. Well, just two miles away, the Shadyside couple selling this home is actually saving money. Loads of it. The county says their home is worth less than half its list price. Yeah, talk about undervalued. Even with that tax cap, the county's low ball assessment saves this couple $30,000 every year. That's $90,000 in savings until the next assessment in 2009. Run down and overtaxed, highbrow and undertax. Dominic Gambino pounds people in less affluent areas like right here in the Mon Valley. And here's how. The latest assessment data shows the Braddock home on the left went down in value, while the Shadyside home on the right went up. Well, capping those values really does nothing for the home on the left. Its value is already dropped. But look at what the cap does to the home on the right. It saves these homeowners more than 12,000 bucks a year in taxes. So the woman on the left pays taxes based on the true market value of her home, but the couple on the right get a huge break. If the appreciating areas are getting a tax break, who is paying the bill? People like the guy who just bought this place. Yeah, look at this. The floors are warped and water damaged. The carpet is rank with mildew. The pipes don't work. Forget about the toilet. Dead bugs and dirt crunch on the steps. Broken windows, holes in the walls, exposed brick, that ceiling that barely hanging on there. This is awful. And there's an upstairs. Yeah, and forget about the dirt foundation or the raw sewage there bubbling up the exposed pipes or that back door that's not even close to being connected. Allegheny County says this mess is worth $37,000. It just sold for five, 5,000 folks. Capping its value makes this homeowner pay seven times the taxes he should. We also found hundreds of homes so undervalued other homeowners make out like bandits. This home on Woodland Road near Chatham College is so exclusive, we can't even walk up the private drive to show it to you. But check out some of the neighbors, and, and you get what I'm talking about. Well, number 77 sold last September for $2.2 million. Now, they would pay $66,000 each year in property tax, but with the cap, they will save more than half. So he pays seven times more. They pay less than half. If our investigation found such blatant bias in the 